Hello friends, I am a Purva Vashist Assistant Professor of Biani Group of College. Welcomes you all on behalf of the Guru KPO. Today I am going to deliver the lecture on lifting machine from the subject mechanics. First of all, I want to tell you know, uh, what is actually lifting machine. Lifting machine is a machine, it is actually a part of machine which actually used to lift something or which used to uh, apply some force over some weight where, uh, with the help of the pulley or with some uh, other machines like the screw jack or any other thing which is used to lift a load or the workforce. A uh, lifting machine is actually of two types. First is simple machine, second is compound machine. Simple machine is normal machine which is used to, uh, uh, which uh, have some effort and used to apply, we used to apply a force on it and some work is being done or some work is being carried out from it. Second is the compound machine in which a force is being applied and the work is done with the, which consists of the some useful simple machine. It means the, uh, there are many simple machine, it consists the compound machine. Compound machine actually made up of many number of simple machine, therefore it is known as the compound machine. There are many terms which is used in the simple machines, like we have effort, load, mechanical advantage, velocity ratio and then the efficiency. What is actually effort? With the term we actually get the meaning of effort. But the uh, but I'll tell you what is the effort. Effort is actually denoted as P. I have denoted as S a P. Effort is a force which we actually apply or which has been applied by the machine uh, to lift up some load or to lift some uh, machine uh, or to lift some weight or from which the work is being done. Next we have the load. Load is the weight which is carried by the machine on which the effort is applied. Then we, uh, then we have the mechanical advantage. Mechanical advantage is the ratio of the load with the effort. It is the ratio of the load and the effort. Mechanical advantage is the ratio of the load and the effort. It is being denoted as the MA. Then we have the velocity ratio. Velocity ratio is being denoted as the VR and it is being given as the velocity of the distance moved by the effort to the distance moved by the weight. It is a unitless quantity which is being denoted as the distance uh, moved by the effort to the move by the load. So here I have told you the four uh, uh, quantities which has been used in the lifting machine. Then we have the other last one that is the efficiency. It is It has been denoted by the eta. And the efficiency is being termed as a ratio of the mechanical advantage to the velocity ratio. Why the efficiency is termed as mechanical advantage to the velocity ratio? The term mechanical advantage is uh, the uh, term efficiency is being uh, the greatest. That is the one when the mechanical ratio and the velocity ratio are equal. So in the idle condition when the mechanical advantage and the velocity ratio are equal, the, velocity, uh, the efficiency is being dumb as 1. The equation will go like MA equals to VR where the efficiency will be equals to 1. Now let us consider an, an example of pulley. When we talk about a simple pulley, then we have the effort being applied at one end, one end of the cord and the second is the tension which has been uh, delivered on the rope uh, by the weight W. The weight W uh, due at the free body diagram when we see. Now getting the free body diagram of the weight, uh, the body, the weight is being acted towards the downward and the tension is acted towards the upward through the pulley. In an idle condition, uh, we say that the pulley is a frictionless substance and the rope, the friction between the rope and the pulley will be zero and the weight of the pulley with respect to the weight will also be termed as zero. Therefore, this is the idle uh, condition and thus the equation is being made, uh, acted upon this. Now, consider this situation when the weight is acting downwards and the tension is upward and in the idle condition, the simple pulley, the T minus W equation will be equals to zero. In an idle condition, the tension and the weight equation will be equals to zero. The force on them, acted on them will be equals to zero. Therefore, T, uh, that is the tension, will automatically be equals to weight at this point. 
and when we come towards the effort point then the tension which has been acted towards here and the uh, effort being applied over here thus the effort will be always equals to the tension therefore from this equation we get the w will be equals to p and from this equation we get the mechanical advantage is a one and the velocity ratio will be equals to mechanical advantage thus the efficiency will be equals to one this is the overview of the lifting machine for further uh, for further knowledge of pulley and other machines you may lo uh, log on to www.gurukpo.com thank you thank you thank you for listening my lecture